Hi everyone, Erin here from Real Wig Fun. Thanks so much for joining me. So today we're gonna to take a look at a brand new Beltress style and this is called Destiny. And I have Destiny in the color Cayenne with Ginger Root. So stay tuned. So first I need to thank my friends at Wigs by Patty's Pearls for supplying this wig so I could bring a review for you today. So I think you've now come to expect my unboxing segment and I did film the unboxing of Destiny. So let's take a look at that and you can see what Destiny looked like straight out of the box and what I did to get it looking just like this. So I hope that helped you to know what to expect when you get Destiny at home and straight out of the box. And I did play around with it a little bit as you saw. So Destiny has a center monofilament part. So the first thing that I did was just to break that part. Now, the one thing that I struggled with just a little bit, but I did, I think I got my arms wrapped around it, were these wispy bangs that you see on either side. So although it is a center monofilament part, this side of the bang sort of tended to want to come across from my left, my right, sorry, my right over to my left. And it just wasn't looking great. So I used a little bit of this Tressilor wig wax um, just to encourage this side of those bangs to part and kind of fall nicely over to the side. And I like it much better now. I did use a little bit of the wig wax on the body of the style as well. So as I mentioned, Destiny is from Belle Tress. It's a brand new style and it's from their cafe collection. And whenever you see a style from Belle Tress indicating cafe collection, all that means is that you can expect it to have heat defiant synthetic fibers. So you could apply heat to this piece, which is really nice. You know, if you wanted to add, a, add more curls, if you wanted to straighten it further, then this fiber allows you to do that. You just wanna keep your heat tools on low and make sure that you're using heat protectant before you apply that heat. I think you can tell that Destiny is sort of a timeless bob, right? It has deconstructed layers and wispy bangs on the side that I talked to you about earlier. But why don't I do a turn so that you could see Destiny on all sides? But before I do that, I did wanna get up close and show you this hairline. So I do have a few random hairs there, um, but the hairline is, is really good because you do have an extended lace all the way into the ear tab, which I really like. And many of Belle Tress's newer styles have that extended lace, which I'm really thrilled to see them bringing to their new styles. Okay, so this is my right side. So you can see sort of those 
deconstructed layers that I talked about. And then the back, my left side, and then back to the front. So if you're a bang wearer, you could absolutely trim these bangs to be, if you wanted to wear them straight down, you absolutely could do that and have your stylist cut them in at a shorter length so that you could wear them straight down. I prefer just to push them off to the side on either side, but if you have the question, can I cut bangs in it? You absolutely can. For me, this style is just really easy to wear. I think it reads quite casual um, and, uh, and a length that many of us feel very comfortable in. So I think that this is a really cute style. For me personally, I don't know that this color is for me and it's distracting me a little bit, but um, I think the style itself is really cute. So as for the dimensions on Destiny, you, these front sections here, these bangs range between four and four and a half inches, okay? The sides range anywhere between eight and 10 inches. The nape is a short nape at two and a half, which I really love because what that means is you're going to have very few friction points with this wig. So therefore it's going to have a good longevity out of this without getting any of the friction against your clothes and on your shoulders. So I love that. And then overall, this wig is between nine and 10 inches and it weighs only 3.8 ounces. So it's incredibly light. It's very comfortable. It is an average size cap. I have a 22 inch circumference head and it's fitting me very comfortably, very traditional to the bell tress styles that I've had in the past. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take Destiny off so that I can show you the inside of her cap. And I had mentioned earlier that it is a center monofilament part, okay? So it is quite narrow. So there's very limited parting space here, but because of that extended lace, even if you don't like a center monofilament part or a center part, I should say, you can it can absolutely look like it's parted off to the side um, from right to left very easily, okay? There is that extended lace right into the ear tabs it's beautiful. The hairline looks really nice along the side of my face. And then you've got felt covered ear tabs, open wefted sides and back. There is not an extended nape. So I'll get up really close. That is a regular nape, that depth. For those new to wig wearing, whenever you see an extended nape, what that means is it would be about double the depth of what we're seeing here. And then these on either side are the Velcro, sorry, the bra strap like adjusters. So I haven't adjusted this out of the box. They're almost all the way out. And again, for my 22 inch circumference head, it's fitting just fine. I think that this wig could fit up to about a 23 inch circumference head. And then certainly if you have a smaller head circumference than I do, there is plenty of room to cinch this in um, for a good fit for your head. Okay, let's talk about this beautiful color, cayenne with ginger root. And as I mentioned, it's new to me. I've never tried this shade. And although I think it's beautiful, I don't just don't love it on myself, but I think many of you will like it, but let's break down the color. Okay. So number one, it is a rooted color. I'll show you the root. It is off black and darkest brown rooting. So it has a very dark root as you can see. And then it's a blend of cayenne, burgundy, red mahogany, and chocolate cherry. It is a gorgeous, gorgeous shade. I wonder what you guys think about it. Drop it in the box uh, below. Let me know in the comments what you think about this shade. So I hope you've enjoyed taking this very quick look at Belle Tress's brand new Destiny in the color Cayenne with Ginger Root. Stay well and stay safe. Bye everybody.